Hey guys, what's going on? It's Daily Tactics' brother here, Daily Productions, here with a little bit of Rise of Liberty, a, uh, a relatively new game, though it has been out for a while, though in, uh, in development still. Uh, and we are going to be playing the Battle of Bunker Hill, so we have a little blurb here from the developer. The Battle of Bunker Hill took place on June 17, 1775 in Massachusetts, marking one of America's first losses to the British. Uh, that's arguable. However, even though America's lost the battle, their force brought major casualties against the enemy and gave the Colonials a significant boost of courage. That's more like it. That's a bit better of a, of a representation there, but we're going to spawn in here as a colonist, and uh, we're going to take on those, those pesky Brits. Um, but yeah, the Battle of Bunker Hill was, uh, was a really neat battle um, in that it was not a victory in your standard sense of the term. However, in terms of the casualties the British lost, the um, amount of morale that was brought to the, you know, American army at the time, or the colonial army, if you will, because America wasn't really a thing at that point, uh, it, it was a huge victory. Uh, we essentially defeated hundreds of British, uh, and the only reason we retreated from Breed's Hill uh, people often think it's Bunker Hill, but that is quite to the contrary there, actually. It was fought on Breed's Hill. Uh, the only reason we retreated was because it was, um, that we were out of ammo. <laughs> we could have held that if, uh, if we had more ammo for hours longer, but, uh, sadly, you know, ammo, ammo does deplete, and, uh, and so the, uh, the colonists did end up having to retreat. Either way, the Brits are coming at us pretty hard right now, and we do have some ammo to hold them back with, so I am just sort of skirmishing right now. Some of my fellow allies taking up against the ramparts here. It seems like we have far fewer men than the colonists, um, or sorry, than the British, but we sniped that guy off the horse there. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I actually have a bit of a, a history in this game, if you will. Um, I know the developer a little bit. He's a very, very nice guy named Jack. Um, and way back when, maybe a year or two ago, probably verging on two years ago, ooh, sniped that British infantryman right there. Uh, we uh, we were chatting, and he sent me a, a version of his game uh, when it wasn't available on the Steam Store. It is available on the Steam Store as of right now, by the way, if you are interested in, um, in getting it for yourself. It's very very reasonably priced. I think it's eight dollars, something like that. Uh, but he had seen some of my videos and was like, hey man, I love your stuff, which means a lot, of course, to a YouTuber. Um, we end up dying there, but we'll redeploy. Oh, here. Come here, guys. Let's go. Uh, I selected them into my unit, and then I believe eight tells them to go towards an objective. So we're going to try and get them going this way. And I think that should work. Oh, I just missed that guy. Um, so either way, he was, he was like, hey man, uh, would you like a copy of my thing? And I was like, yeah, sure. And daily gaming wasn't huge at the time. Um, oh my god, help. I had had a few successful videos in, uh, I had a, a series going on called the, oh my god, help, <laughs> called the Trump's Wall series, and those went viral. Um, but beyond that, nothing, nothing too big. And I wasn't really doing Star Wars videos anymore because I was a bit tapped out at the time. Uh, so that's sort of my my situation at that moment was I, oh, I died again. Um, I really, I wasn't doing too hot on the YouTube front. I wasn't like upset about it or bitter or anything. It's just, you know, I wasn't pulling the views because I was playing the games that I really wanted to play. And so he contacted me and I was like, heck yeah, I want to play this game. It looks sick. Uh, and then he promoted the crud out of my video and it was one of the few videos at the time that I had uploaded besides the like one Star Wars video I was doing a month that like reached over 5k views or something like that so that was really cool and he he definitely brought a large portion of his audience to my channel so um, the guy's a really nice fellow and he supports creators and he he I'm pretty sure he's a one-man dev team he was at least at the time I don't know if he's expanded since then uh, because the game honestly looks fantastic now it's come so far oh, I died again um, it has come just exceptionally far in terms of development and things like that so I'm wondering if maybe he he got some more people but um, honestly if he didn't and he's continued to be a one-man team on this thing then props to him that is just infinitely impressive to me uh, that he's still maintaining this to this day by himself and things like that um, so 
huge props to that guy. I genuinely think that you guys should check him out if you haven't yet. We're putting up a bit of a front over here as the colonists. We've sort of lost our defensive position uh, on the hills in front of the harbor, which is obviously not a good thing. That That's sort of where we were set up, and now we're... We're sort of at a loss right now. Actually, let's pick up the map. I don't I don't know the positioning super well. Um, so we're right here. We're that white dot. They've captured sort of those barricades. Are there... Oh, there's more barricades way, way back there. Okay, I understand now. So we're still good for the most part, I would argue. Um, we just kind of need to push back to our further defenses and we can see some cannonballs striking through there there's some cavalry starting to poke out at our other defenses I'm gonna try and hit these guys pretty hard with some guerrilla warfare um, tactics through the trees and whatnot uh, we got our boy here he's a part of our squad why don't you just hold position here with me man oh big mess big mess big whiff right there uh, but yeah, I was sort of planning on playing maybe a few of these matches of uh, of Rise of Liberty because I think it's a really, really fun and unique game, and I, I think it could be really, really cool. Oh, there's actually some guys putting up an assault on our old hill. I think we should head back there and try and try and take it back with them, maybe support the, the lads a little bit. Um, but yeah, I was planning on maybe doing a few of the battles, things like that. Um, it's of course all American Revolution and, and whatnot, so it uh, could be really neat. All right, man, let's hold this position here. Or are you gonna you're gonna walk away? No, you're good. Okay, well, let's try and take. A oh, that's a lot of them. Oh, and he's dead. Oh, and I'm dead. <laughs> okay. Um, where are we gonna deploy if we deploy? We just sort of deploy in a random spot. In fact, in front of a ton of Brits. Uh, can we get on this horse? Yes, please. Oh, yes. Okay. Reload the old weapon while we hop on this horse, and we're gonna try and get back to our our other boys' defenses over here, which seems to be under some scrutiny from the the British invaders here. Oh, tried to go for the no, I got shot off the horse. I I flew a little close close to the sun there, and keeps on spawning me in front of a bunch of Brits. Uh, don't don't put me here. This is not where I want to be. Help. Oh, jeez, they're everywhere. Oh, my God, I got to get back to our fort. Got to back, get back to our guys. I see them all, like, just peppered. I am, I'm deep behind enemy lines. I see them peppered across this foliage of the forest. All right, we're going to try and... Oh, okay. Please don't shoot me, sir. All right, I need to, I need to hide because he's reloading. And if I, if I pop out to the right over there... Oh, but there's, there's the entire army right there. This is not good. Okay. Okay. Now we just have to book it. Oh, there's more guys up here, though. All right, reload while we go. Oh, geez, there's four guys over there. So if we go around the flank, maybe we can get into the fortress position a little bit better. Oh, some cannons just absolutely saved us right there. Were those enemy cannons that were trying to hit us but hit the enemy? A little bit of collateral damage there, I guess. Okay, we're at the force. You can see where our cavalry charge just went wrong, and I die right before. No! Ugh, can we switch where we come up at? This is a, not the greatest system. I, ge I guess we can only spawn here, which kind of sucks. Oh, jeez. Okay, so we're just going to keep on spawning behind enemy lines here. Why? <laughs> Why, game? Why do you keep doing this to me? Okay, you're coming at me, dude. I'm going to hide behind this tree. Boom. You're dead. <laughs> I gotta say, the death animations are pretty sweet. I mean, you, there's just this poof of blood, and then they, they just fall. It, it's pretty epic, I gotta say. Oh, man. Yeah, so Daily Productions has just sort of been focusing for the mo Oh, God, cavalry's charging at me. It's been, for the most part, sort of focusing on these little um, indie games. A lot of stuff. Oh, British victory. Dang it! All right, let's let's try let's try playing from the other side, and we can we can keep this going for a little bit. All righty then, you bad Larrys. Now we are the British, spawning in uh, amongst this sort of coastal town here. We gotta sally forth and take what's rightfully ours, the colonies, and these dang colonists who are revolting need to be put in their place. I'm gonna hop on a cavalry real quick, and I can already hear some cannons coming at us. Looks like our, our troops are lining up here. Oh my god, that was brutal. I don't want to get hit by one of those. Oh my goodness. 
All right, but but we do have to inspect the men, you know. All right, men, you're good. Double time. <laughs> it's kind of dope. I'm gonna take command. All right, so we got 23 under our command. We're gonna lead the charge. We're gonna lead the charge ahead. All these guys that are sort of out of formation are mine. You know, we we don't we toot by our own horn. We don't we don't go with the rest of them. We're gonna order them to attack right there, and I'm getting hit already by enemy fire. Ooh, okay, take him out. No, I'm dead. <laughs> uh, my goodness, I suck. Okay, we'll just respawn. It's fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> oh man. But at least our boys, we can see them up on the hill there, just taking names right now. Absolute mad lads. Love it. Let's grab another horse here. And we got more Brits coming up too, getting into formation and things like that. I remember when this first this game first came out, the troops looked nothing to this detail. They were basically like cube men, um, which in its, in of itself had its own sort of unique feel to it, which was kind of cool. But to see this game evolve over time is really spectacular. Not to mention just the fact that it was one man's dream to make a video game, and he did it, and he made it about something he loved, and it's come to be this this pretty big cult following. I mean, his Discord server is huge. Um, it's pretty inspiring. And I I have to say, if you haven't checked this game out, be sure to. Um, oh my God, there's a there's a random Yankee over here. It looks like our toy brothers are trying to deal with him, but they're out of bullets. I, I got you guys. Don't worry. Don't worry. That's sniper shot. <laughs> that was awesome. Okay. He must have just charged forward. He was like, I, he, I'm done with this. I'm, I'm coming forward. Let's try and take out this cannon. Okay. We missed. So let's back out. We're getting hit. We're getting hit. Get out of here. Thank you. Okay. Okay. All right. Reload the old weapon here. This Pfeiffer is alone. Sorry, drummer, not a Pfeiffer. What am I talking about? I got my instruments. The instruments messed up. Oh, these things have no range. I mean, they are muskets, so it makes sense. Oh, there's a bit of a cavalry charge over here. Don't mind if I do. We'll join them. Looks like they're going after this leftmost cannon. The Yanks, when not under my... I hit the cannon. When not under my prestigious command, seem to be <laughs> faring far better in this battle, so I guess props to them. All right, here we go. Huge cav charge right now. Huge. Big plays. Boom. All right, now let's uh, try and melee some of these boys. Ugh. Nope. I missed, and I died. <laughs> of course. Uh, can we select the weapon? I don't think we can, actually, because I, I was checking it out. You have to unlock them. Um, I, I totally forgot for a second there, so uh, we're going to have to wait on that. Wait, actually, unless... Did we unlock any? Three kills to unlock. I've definitely gotten three kills, my dude. Oh, that's all right. And then how do we get back to the... Oh, there you go. It's it's kind of a glitchy menu system. I mean, it is still a work in progress, so there's still some stuff that needs to be worked on, obviously. But uh, honestly, the strides he's taken in this game is amazing. Because originally, there were no houses. There were no barrels. There were no tents. It was just you'd spawn in the middle of like an open field and brawl it out with hundreds of troopers. But... Now it's really come together to be something neat, you know? I love that. I love the, the good old underdog story. Either way, we are very much so struggling to take this position. You know what? I think I need to command some troopers here. I think we need to get a nice, solid attack going and, you know, really commit to it. Because right now we're getting butchered. It's 350 to zero. We need to take some, take some stuff here, so... You lads, come with me, um, and we will go ahead and, I think it's eight, right? Eight? No? Uh, maybe we have to be closer. There we go. All right, so I'm ordering them forward to attack here. Onwards and upwards. Okay. Provide some cover fire. Big misses, though. That's all right. That's all right. All right, we see some musket fire rounding off right now. Okay, big plays, big plays, guys. God, I keep missing. Maybe I need to, I need to target people closer. Okay, just cause some disruption up here. Very good, very good. Yeet. Okay, yammed on him. Oh, I went for the. Nope. Okay. <laughs> I keep going for the melee. I just don't think it's uh, it's super possible. 
What is happening? Ah, help. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, I deployed with a lantern. <laughs> How do I get my secondary weapon? What's the control for that? Wait. What, what are the controls here? That's... Wait. That, those aren't controls. <laughs> Excuse? Wait, maybe I can... Wait. Uh, weapon select? Primary? I don't, I don't want the lantern. Ah, there we go. Okay, cool. I got my flintlock pistol back. No, this isn't a flintlock pistol. This is a... Okay, so two gives you the flintlock pistol. That would have actually been a good thing to utilize because I kept running out of ammo. But now we know. Now we know. Okay, let's try another charge here because that, that one went better than what we were previously doing for sure. Um, our men aren't really attacking all that much in all honesty. Let's try and gather, like, as many as we possibly can. Ow. Alright. That's 34. 34 troopers. I'm a little bit injured, but I think we're going to be able to do this. Um, get attacking that way. I ordered them to skirmish ahead. Come on, lads. No? You don't? Wait. Let me see. There we go. Now we're going. Okay, I'll wait for my boys to come up. We're going to go in together. Here we go. Yeah, stop to fire as we go. Let's go do Nope, okay. <laughs> oh, yes. This is the stuff, boys. This is the stuff. Okay. The dream. Make it come true, lads. Make it come true. We got to put these, these dang rebels in their place. All right. Now switch the side arm and I die. <laughs> I wish there was a way to control where you spawn. That'd be so nice. But uh, evidently, there really isn't. All right, so our, our lads are still up there sort of firing away. You can see the smoke sort of billowing from where they, they've they been firing. Let's hop on this horse. We're to our last horse over here. Um, let's try and get these guys to come up with us. Yeah, just follow me. Just follow me. We're not going to give attack orders. We're just going to have them follow me. Actually, in fact, you know what? The attack's going well up here now, so have them attack up there with them. There we go. Alright. Actually, I'm getting off the horse, because every time I'm on the horse, I overextend and I die. We see some cannons firing ahead. That's good. That means we got backup. Nice. Nice dome shot right there. Duck behind this hill right quick. Reload the old weapon here. We're getting hit by some heavy suppressive fire. Alright, the group we just brought up is coming up with us. We're taking the flag. We are taking the flag. That's good. Alright, now switch to the sidearm. Nice. Double kill. Whew, okay. I wonder if the sidearm has a faster reload. It does seem to, actually. Probably has a way worse range, though. And this thing has it's got a bad range, too. So, I mean, that's probably saying something. Alright, they're doing a counter charge with their cavalry. Alright, good. We're, we're wiping it out, though. It's, oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> we are wiping out the cavalry charge for the most part. Come on, guys. Yeah, there we go. Uh, so that's good. The cab actually in this game is pretty dangerous. Which, I mean, it probably should be. Think about it, you know? Oh, okay. Everyone died from that cannon blast. I'm going to just hide in the tent while I reload my weapon here. <laughs> Give me some cover. Okay. Reload both weapons. Make sure we're, we're fully prepared for this. We've taken the flag. Good. Excellent. But is it too late? I mean, we've sustained some losses here pretty heavily. It's not great. All right. They're still holding the right flank here. It looks like we do have some boys lower down fighting against them. So we're coming up to support here a little bit. I'm going to reload, and then we'll have the pistol and the musket to fire. That means two kills almost guaranteed. There's one... And the other two dropped without me having to do anything. Oh, but there's some more lads over here. Ooh, nice. Okay, that wasn't the guy I was aiming for, but we still got a kill. <laughs> so, yeah, the accuracy on this thing is not spectacular. Yep, not spectacular. <laughs> that's okay, that's okay. Oh, jeez. Someone kill him. Someone kill him. Guys, it's one dude. Come on. I swear to God, if, if he kills one of us. There we go. All right, you know what? Oh, I don't have that reloaded. 
<laughs> okay, that's a little derpy. The melee could use some work. Okay. My little band of troopers, come with me. We're, we're gonna start our attack on the next position. We got 14 merry men. Now 12. That's okay. Um, you know, let's try and attach some of the cavalry to our troopers, too. Okay, now we have 16. So we have 12 and... 12 troopers, 4 cal... Or, yeah, 4 cavalry, I think, is what we should have. Which is good. Oh, we needed to capture that flag, too. Good thing our, our troopers are smarter than I am. Whew. Okay. So now we have to take the big boy hill. Um... Which should be pretty challenging, but uh, we'll, we'll see if we can do it here. I don't know. Oh, there are a few skirmishers out along the trees. <laughs> All right, let's watch out for this guy. Yep, absolutely toasted. <laughs> uh, there's a few guys back there, but like we have troops back there, so I think it should be okay. Actually, there's quite a number of troopers over there. Let's see. Big plays, but didn't pay off. Okay. You know, it's fine. We're going to start the assault without the remainder of our army. They should be coming in rather soon. So, I fully expect these troopers to die. Uh, but, <laughs> the men that come in after... Oh, we're actually following a cab charge. That's actually very good. So, maybe we won't die here. Um, but, yeah, the men who come in after, I think, will be fine. Actually, we, we have a sizable force. I take everything I've said back. And the cavalry softened them up for us a little bit already. So... I expect good things from this. Alright, let's real quick reload our pistol. I should have done this moments ago. It's fine, whatever. Ow, and I got shot and died. Oof. Big oof right there. And they deploy me in the very back of the map. Ugh. <laughs> That's the most obnoxious part. I don't think I have a... Uh, I don't think I have a horse. I think there might be one up there on the hill that I died on and... Yeah, there's, there's one up there. Okay. And we can also collect some of these guys who are just holding position back here. And just sort of get them to come up with us. So it's not a complete loss. We'll, we'll rejuvenate our forces a little bit. We can see some of our, our boys in the back line, see what they're doing. Looks like we've taken possession of the Yankee. Um, I almost said Yankee candles, which would be kind of funny. But the Yankee artillery pieces. All right, so we got 13 troopers under our command right now. Let's wait for, wait for a few more to sort of collect around us so we can have a bit larger of a force. Okay. 21. That's good. That's a good number. And uh, we will begin our assault. Let's go to the left over here. I am considerably faster than our men. I just want to scout the area ahead a little bit. They'll get to us. They'll make it to us. I also want to see what's... Oh! Hey, guys. We won the battle. I, since I've never seen what the inside of this fortress really looks like, let's just ride over here and check it out. That was actually kind of a close one. Um, it took us a lengthy amount of time to really get going there. <laughs> but uh, we finally did take it. Okay, so yeah, this is a pretty, pretty tough position. It's fairly surrounded on all sides by trenches and cannons and things like that, but we persevered. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Comment and subscribe if you did. Let me know if you want to see some more of this content, and uh, I will see you all in the next one. Peace. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Be sure to click that subscribe button for more content, and hit the notification bell if you'd like to be alerted to whenever I live stream or upload. Thanks so much.